All right, inject the vehicle up. And I'm getting mighty tired of your trifling ways and of listening to that jackass bray. I always use the jack stand. Lord, All right, back to removing the tire. Got the wheel jacked up. Got the car jacked up. Man. Lexus, baby. Let's go. Whew. Nice racing tire. I normally put these underneath the car, but I'm just going to slide this to the side. All right, now we on the back side. We're going to loosen this bolt and this bolt. Back. <laughs> now I'm switching hands. All right, so now I got the brakes off. Well, I got my other pads to take off, but these are the pads that I'm gonna use. Wherever gold, premium brake pads, black pads, brake pads, premium gold. Put it back, so I know what you're saying. More cheap, but. Money, money. All right, so we're back here at the brakes. Remove the holes. Should slide right out. Like so. You can definitely see the difference though in the new ones to the old, the thickness. Stand under here. And keep from pulling on the um, cable. I'm gonna use the C-clamp and <clears throat> decompress the caliper so that we can get the new pads back on. Otherwise, they won't fit. So with the old pads off, we'll replace place it with the new ones. Have the indicator up at the top. And stand slide like so. so. Slide right in. Same for the back side. So now we're replacing the caliper back in place. See it bumps, just slide it over. And replace our bolts. Before I put my caliper on, pull up antecedents on this bolt. I mean, this was super hard to take off. So maybe it won't be so hard next time. Remember, I didn't even loosen it. Oh, don't strip it. All right, so then just tighten this back up.
rear brake job done. What I also like to do Since I got the wheels off, put a little anesthesia on the lug nuts on these bolts. And then replace the tire, and that is it. Do the same thing for the other side, and brake job complete. That's the Lexus 350F Sport rear wheel brake job. Thanks for watching.